Hey, today we're going to talk about having some problems with the Roku, the uh, HDCP unauthorized notification and the purple screen. Mine was flashing here and there and then just got really bad uh, where it was all you, the video was playing in the background but all you saw was the purple screen and uh, we're going to fix that not by just powering off, rebooting, resetting the cables, all that stuff. This is the real fix for me. Uh, I went to settings and uh, display type and when you're on display type you have a choice over here you can choose I chose when I set it up auto detect and assumed that would be the right way to do it um, just by chance I went in and uh, tried to change that I tried the 60 Hertz which I believe my TV is a 60 Hertz but it wasn't working um, I went to the 30 Hertz and boom cleared up all my problems as you can see I'm gonna go to Netflix I'm gonna hit play no problems all right good luck uh, fixing your Roku all right guys in the end if you look real close at this video this is uh, this cable. This was the cable I had to take off. This was, uh, I guess it would be an HDCP 1.4. Anyway, what it doesn't say on it is it doesn't say high speed. Look at the new cable. And if I got it from Amazon, high speed HDMI cable. This is the HDCP 2.2. This is what uh, solves the problem on the Roku that's not coming in on 4K and you get the uh, purple screen all the time. This ended up being the fix.